adaptive innovation is a, an innovation that is about the discovery process itself. So we don't have clear goals uh, to why we're innovating, but we're exploring new ideas. We're discovering what is possible. So this is very important for actually new ideas to emerge at all. Usually we think in the context of uh, our systems that are already in place. So we see the current paradigm. But adaption is really exploring on the ground uh, new ideas that might become useful to the current services that the government is providing or might also challenge uh, those services or systems that are in place. So people really need to have the allowance and room from a bottom-up perspective to explore new ideas. And that is about adaption. So those people working together closest to the pe uh, people themselves can draw upon the signals uh, coming from uh, citizens' lives and innovate uh, accordingly or test out or experiment with things um, based on the feedback they get from the system itself. Some transformative things can emerge uh, from that, but uh, maybe some uh, enhancement-oriented innovation can emerge from adaption as well. So both are very much needed. And uh, for example, different uh, adaption, adaptive innovations have emerged in different countries. For example, in Canada, uh, people uh, by the side of their desk have been working on different apps to make their uh, regulatory system more easily absorbable to people themselves. So to make apps that uh, make it easy to understand if I, for example, establish a company, what kind of regulation applies for me? So the problem switches from having too much regulation, but actually making it understandable for people. So not, not the problem is not anymore about making regulation simple, but making it understandable and usable for the client itself. So that comes from adaption.